hello YouTube viewers welcome back to another video tutorial in this tutorial I'm just going to cover changing a NordVPN server in Asus Merlin firmware without further ado I'm going to jump straight on in there it's going to take should be any more than a two or three minute video so first of all open a browser of your choice first of all you're going to need to go and get uh, the server details so what we'll do is recommend going to this web address which is nordvpn.com forward slash servers forward slash tools and it'll bring you to this website I'll leave a link in the description select your country in this case we want the UK I know there's one on the left but we're just going to do that uh, it's giving me a recommended server of 1879 so I'm just going to highlight that and copy that and then you're going to need to log into your router uh, if you've had the router from us the IP address is going to be 192.168.12.1 if not you're going to know your own IP of the router you're going to be greeted with your screen you log in with a username and password that you've been given or obviously that you've set uh, click sign in um, we're going to go to any any information that you see is grayed out or sort of covered is just personal information so select on the VPN tab on the left click VPN client and you'll see here this is the node VPN now yours might be client one um, and this isn't running at the moment in time but if you wanted to change the server all you do is come down to here where it says server address and port highlight the address that you've already got in there or the IP address so you're better off with the domain because if ever they change the IP it doesn't go off paste your new details into there which is obviously you're going to see now it's changed the server address come down to the bottom and click apply and that's it basically now that will be going to a different server UK 1879 and that's it guys we're just going to leave it there hopefully that was short and sweet it was just a request of a customer so uh, we said we'd do one for you so uh, hope that helps and uh, catch you on the next one thanks for watching